Well, welcome in. We're here with edition two of Kieran in Japan. And uh, I'm here in Akashima City in Tokyo. And behind me, you've got a charity match going on between the Australian High Commission and members of the National Women's and Men's Team for Japan and some other major supporters of Japan cricket. Um, this game was actually supposed to happen on the 12th of March this year. But obviously, the day before, the world saw one of uh, the worst natural disasters in history uh, with the earthquake and subsequent tsunami. It really affected the northern areas of Japan and, in fact, the whole country. So, this match is a charity match to raise funds for the affected victims of that tsunami. Um, we've got good support. Emma, maybe if we can just stretch around and see some of the uh, support we've got here for this match. Awesome. So, um, as Emma pans back to me, contrary to some vicious rumours that are going around, uh, this trip is not just a beer drinking trip for me, I am here to help with cricket. So I will have a cricket ball and a cricket bat in hand and you will see me doing some coaching. Um, so I thought with this one, this uh, edition here, I could give you a bit of a feel for where Japan cricket is currently at. And um, obviously there is some cricket that's, that's played, you can see behind me there's a game going on. Cricket really started in, in the universities in Japan and then um, sort of built from there with the ICC investing money through its global development program. And really my role here is to help Japan Cricket develop a primary school strategy to really build the junior base. And our three main target areas are Sano, where Japan Cricket is based, and you saw me last week, Gumma and uh, Chiba. So um, you'll catch me in uh, helping with the coaching of some of the Sano junior programs. And I'm actually uh, coming out of an 18-month retirement tomorrow to play for the Sano Cricket Club at, uh, at the Sano Cricket Ground. So we'll catch you there. Thanks. So we're in Sano, we're coming out of an 18 month retirement for this club game here. Auckland Aces represent. Well, let's go. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. New Zealand no Oklando から来ました。私は日本に6月末まで滞在,在します。とクリケットを小学校で教えます。クリケットはニュージーランドでとっても人気があります。あの最初に。Catching practice, catching rain shoe. Tanoshimo! Hi, Ine! Stand up! Hitori EQ! You got it there! Oh! Jukai! Jukai! This is session number three and uh, very difficult running a whole session in Japanese but we're getting there. Yo! Gambare! Yo ten! Well, this just about wraps it up of uh, the second video blog of me here in Japan. We're at Trinity, um, which is the place where Japan Cricket has paid for all my dinners and all my lunches. It's very nice of them. It's just across the road from their offices. And um, as I was saying earlier, cricket in Japan has focused uh, its efforts in three main areas. And this area here, Sano being one of them. And I guess one of the reasons I've been able to <coughs> do so well here in Sano is people like the owner of this restaurant here. So we're going to walk through and uh, we're going to meet Dainani san. There's his lovely wife Yuko. Konbanwa. <laughs> and Dainani san makes the number one gyozas in town. Yours are. And there he is. Konbanwa. 
お元気ですか超元気はい And for paying around here's Shizuka-san and Makoto-san Yeah. Yeah. Shizuka-san, the lovely Hi. wife of Alex Noaki Miyagi, the CEO of Japan Cricket. Makoto-san, the operations manager at Japan Cricket. So as you can see, it's the famous uh, haunt for all the Japan Cricket people. And uh, where's that article? If you look in close here, I am the local celebrity. So I don't know what that says, but probably something like, that guy is a legend. Um, that guy right there. So yeah, as I was saying, it's for people like uh, Donnelly san over here that Japan cricket has been able to really develop in Sano because of the, the links he has. He knows the local mayor and uh, he knows all the people around town that can open a lot of doors, which is very difficult for cricket as a new sport. So uh, I hope you've enjoyed this edition. Next week uh, I'm going to head over to Chiba, which is near Tokyo, and uh, catch some of the action in Chiba. And um, I'm actually going to be staying in Tokyo in one of the capsule hotels. So you can spend a night with me in the capsule hotel in Tokyo. I'll see you there. All right. See you later. Sayonara.